Welcome back, folks, to Let's Play The Ninja Warriors for the Super Nintendo. I'm Sam Rotex, and when we last left off, we did defeat stages 3 and 4 last time, so now we're on stage 5. This music is making me dance, but without further ado, how about we continue this dance? And let's fight. Well, first, let's just go forward. Ooh, a motorcycle. What are we going to do with it? Pick it up and throw it at you. Because I knew people were coming. They always leave vehicles behind when they know that um, any enemies are in sight. Hi! So we're facing suited people, which is okay. And I think we've killed them both. Okay, now we killed one of them. Okay, now we've killed them both. So yeah, the game's getting a bit tougher, but you know, I don't mind. Oh god, robots. Right, let's go this way and... Oh, haha, <laughs> you missed your la- Ow! That's what I get for laughing. I was about to say, you missed your laser attack, bud. Seems the robot doesn't like me anymore. Well, he never liked me to begin with, but still. Let's just keep attacking. We can keep throwing him. Yes, throwing him. I've learnt this new technique now. I can just go close and just grab enemies and just throw them. Just fr Okay, never mind. I got thrown myself. But yeah, that's what I'm going to keep doing to people. Just throw them. Yep. Just casually welcome them to a grab. Whether you use your hair to throw them, which is a pretty cool move. Or you just, just dash and throw them, like the way the Kanoichi is, then you're all good. You're really good right now, but um, yeah, I'm just going to keep throwing. That's going to be my new secret technique, the throw of knowledge, aka spamming. And there's a head explosion. Now let's go forward. Okay, our health is doing fine. Oh, hello, bro. Bloody little Wolverine midget. Yeah, I don't know what to call him. I'm just going to call this guy Baby Wolverine Midget. Oh, oops, I forgot to jump. Okay, that was a bit dumb. Right, now you're both dead. I mean, they're going to give me more midgets to fight. More Wolverine midgets. Hey, fro. <laughs> I love it. Hey, fro. Right. Throw you with my hair. Whip my hair back and forth and throw it. I love the fact that she ties them with the hair. And then, like, she still has a lot of hair left over. It's like magic hair. Well, then again, the hair is pretty magic if she ain't losing any hair. Then again, the Kanoichi is an android, so yeah. Uh, pff, what do I know? Yeah, I love throwing people. Come on, get over here. We don't really need to use our special. I think probably the next time I use my special is, is probably a boss fight. Because, I mean, some of the bosses do get a bit tougher. I was about to say, can you not throw me? But um, I instead end up yawning, which... Um, stop me mid-sentence but yeah you don't throw me ever again you loser right let's jump up even though the game does it for us the music changed hooray i do love when the music changes actually music so catchy let's throw out a wolverine oh there's two of you now two baby wolverines that's okay can you die please thank you and i'm gonna kill you by throwing it at you and give me my energy. Thank you. Wait, you're not... Now you're dead. I was about to say, you're not dead. Now you... Now he died. Yeah, um... I really should learn how to block more. To be honest, you can block in this game. Um... If you hold the Y button, you block. But obviously, um, for the first few stages, I haven't really needed the block button because there's always been health. But the next stage, there is no health. So the block button is going to be very, very handy. Especially because there's going to be no health. So yeah, what we're going to do is probably... You'll see what I mean when we go to the next stage. But for now, um, let's just beat this level. Let's focus on this current level right now. Before we even think about talking about the next stage. Ouch. Bloody baby Wolverines, man. Or midget, midget Wolverines. I, I, don't, I don't know what to call them. I'm just going to call them midget Wolverines. They're so annoying. Like, um... I really don't like it. It's just like, let me punch you up. But, you know, the midgets are just so annoying. I'm just going to beat the midgets. You know, the midgets are my top priority now. The midgets are pretty much the threat. The midget, yeah, the midget, the midget wolverines. So, so I'm just going to call them midget wolverines. I know I keep repeating the word midget, but then they're, they're, they're small. And like, you can, you can attack them from um, high, but I do recommend you use low attacks on them because it's just so... <coughs> Sorry. It's just so annoying. But yeah, um, how dare I cough mid-sentence. Right, um, 
just keep going. I think he's there. We go. I was about to say, I think he's there. Oh no! Stop giving me these little midgets. Not four of them. I don't like having two of them, let alone four. Like, come on. You know what? I've got you all in the corner now. That means I'm gonna beat you. Oh, never mind. Right. Oh god, it's um an old version of Ken. I don't, oh, he burnt me because I called him Ken. Oops. Right, so yeah, I'm just gonna use. I did use my special. I'm not gonna lie. I used it. Why? Because to get rid of the guy with the fire, and he's dead, just like that. Let's stand here. Just charge up our special meter. There we go. Oh, energy. Right, let's throw out that Wolverine and grab the energy. Thank you. Now let's kill this Wolverine. Thank you. Get out of the way. I don't really like the Wolverines in my way, but um, they're going to keep being in my way because. This game loves giving you the baby wolverines, or the midget wolverines. Or oh, midget sabertooth. However you want to call it, midget sabertooth wolverine thing. Because he's he's got the look of sabertooth, and he's got the claws like wolverine. Or you could call him baby vega. Baby hairy vega. Well, vega's only got one claw, so he can't really be vega. So baby wolverine it is. Baby, sa baby wolvertooth. Last one I'm going to call it wolvertooth. There we go, we finally found a name. It dresses like Sabretooth and it looks like Wolverine. Wolvertooth. There we go. I almost forgot what I called it, but Wolvertooth. That's what I'm going to call them little midgets. Wolvertooth. Right, I think we're going to face the boss now. Yes, we are. Now he's sitting there. Hello, nice to meet you. Can you fight? Uh, I'm at a disadvantage, but um, sometimes these boss bosses don't really block. Uh-oh, there we go. As I say, sometimes these bosses don't block, so I should be okay. There we go. Just use the um, just use the enemies just to be a um, little bit of a wall as well. Okay, I guess the boss was the one that blocked my attack, but that's okay. I'm not really too concerned by that. I'm just going to keep doing my thing, see? And then bring him out. And then he's going to probably do his... Uh, there we go. I was about to say he's about to do his special, but it didn't really matter to me. They've barely done... He's barely done any sort of damage towards me. Like... Yeah, see, look, he's barely done any damage. And he's defeated because I threw him out like trash. Stage 5, target destroyed, mission complete. Okay, my phone is actually ringing as we speak, so, um, yes, I'm going to take this phone call quickly once we can press start, that is. Stage 6, operation start. Now I'm going to press start because I'm going to be right back. And we're back, folks, so let's get going, shall we? I think it's time we get going because yeah we're really gonna take out um stage six. Oh yeah like i said this is the stage that um you're going to need a lot of health and you're gonna need to block all right let's destroy these trophy um, these statues i don't i think it's time to do some anterior decorating decorating i mean decorate i sound australian the way i just pronounced decorating <laughs> but it's okay um yeah, let's just um, continue on with the decorations. And I uh, just blew up them, because why not? Right, let's throw you over. Oh god, it's Wolvertooth. Right, you can get over there, Wolvertooth. Right, let's just beat up Wolver... Wolvertooth is the biggest threat for me out of all these enemies. But Wolvertooth... Oh, I was about to say Wolvertooth is dead. Now he's dead, I believe. I threw him, now he's dead. There we go. Yeah, we're going to leave that little bust alone. We we'll leave... Um, this place with some um, good decorations, but we're also going to be out there to destroy them, so let's front. There we go, excellent. Right, now let's attack you. Yeah, I didn't forget. Who said you could punch me? Who actually said you could punch me? The answer is nobody. Thank you. Kick you. Now we're going to use our special in about a few seconds. Now, there we go. Aha! Wolvertooth died. That alone is very good. Right, let's attack you. Right, there we go. Now we're going to throw you. Yeah, we're going to start doing the throwing game now. Yes, throwing is your best friend. And blocking. Well, I didn't really need to do much blocking here. But um, you'll see where I need to block. Blocking is very helpful, but I don't think um, I really need it yet. But that was a good hair throw. And he's down. Cool. Oh, wow, I got a lot of... Now he's down. Hair throw. Hey, hair throw. Now we're dancing to the music. Alright, so this is where I said we need to block this particular boss fight. Because you're not fighting one enemy, you're fighting two. Great music, by the way. Ah, we've got this under wraps, don't we? We're going to use that first before we lose it. Now we're going to jump behind you, just throw you. Yeah, what we need to do is just get behind these enemies at all times. 
or if you can, just jump a lot because that attack is pretty dangerous. Don't let them grab you either because if you let them grab you, it will take like a lot of your health. If you're playing on hard difficulty, I think it takes more than half, nearly half your health actually, so that's friggin' terrible. But um, yeah, we're just gonna stay behind and um, in between them. Yeah, that sounds a bit good. And let's jump. See, there we go. The reason why I jumped is because they were doing that jump kick thing. See, look, if you do, if you do that, or you can just block. You can just block them when they do that. So yeah, do try your best to not get hit a lot. See? Oh god. Oh god. All right. So that took. See, it didn't take too much of my health because I'm playing normal, but probably would have been dead, nearly dead to be honest. But they haven't. Oh, okay. They've hit me twice now. I know they've hit me more than twice, but it feels like they've hit me just twice. They've hit me up at least four times, but, um, uh oh, that is not good. Okay, they got little health left. I've got an advantage. Woo! Haha, <laughs> stage six, target destroyed. Mission complete. Hey, hey. Explosion. I feel so good now. <laughs> right, um, younger me would have died constantly at that stage. Stage 7, start operation. Yeah, I would have died a lot. Oh yeah, this is where I'm going to stop the video. Man, I'm enjoying this game. I'm kind of sad that it's coming to an end. And I'm kind of happy I've gone back to beat-em-ups. It's been a very long time since I last did a beat-em-up. So, I believe it was time for me to actually do one. And um, actually play one. So yeah, here I am playing one. But will I be doing more beat-em-ups down the line? Yes, I will. Because Streets of Rage 4 is around the corner. I need to warm up my beat-em-up gloves. So yeah, <laughs> I still use that word. But... No more Wolver 2s, I hope, for the next part, but I bet you there will be more Wolver 2s. But when we come back on Thursday, folks, we're going to be tackling Stage 7 and probably finish the rest of the game. Until then, until then, thank you guys for watching, and I shall see you guys on Thursday. Goodbye!